So I wanted to make a video on how I do a keto vor diet on a budget. So over the past two days, I've gotten all of this meat. I've spent around less, no, about $140 on all of this meat. And I'm going to, uh, between three different stores. So the way that I do it is one, I use the Flip app to look at different circulars to see what's on sale. So this week, or it's a bi-weekly circular at Cousins, they had ribeye steaks on sale for $7.99 a pound, and they're boneless because my um, my ShopRite also had ribeye steaks on sale for $7.99 a pound, but they were bone in. So I figured that the boneless ones would be a better price because you're not paying for the bone. So this is what they came out to. They're pretty small, but you know, can't beat ribeye. So I got one, two, three, and these are, they're about three in a pack here. Three, four, and I got the best looking ones that I could. Um, let's see, did I get, oh, um, from Cousins, I also got the two packs of these white shrimp and they are raw peeled and deveined and they were $9.99 a bag for um, two pound bags which is a great deal for peeled and deveined so you don't have to do any work I <laughs> basically just rinse them off thaw them out rinse them off and season them up and cook them um, so those are deals that I found without having to do anything extra although I do do a little bit extra so um, at ShopRite or near me um, I have a fresh grocer which is a subsidiary of ShopRite. I go to my ShopRite at 8.30 in the morning and I can always find these yellow stickers, um, which are the manager specials for 30% off. So you get there early enough at the store, you can get these 30% off and you save money, obviously, um, on the meat. So I got this bone-in ribeye at 30% off which is regularly $9.99 a pound. So that makes this bone and ribeye $7 a pound at 30% off. And this is a family pack. So there's two big husky ribeyes in there. Uh, this is a chuck roast at 30% off. Was originally $5.99 a pound. So that'll be great for roast. And this is another ribeye. Yep, a giant bone and ribeye again. So $7 a pound for ribeye. Now they are not cut exactly how I typically want them. Um, they're not as thick, you know, because I didn't go to the butcher, but they're about, let me see. Oh, actually, that's not that bad. They're about an inch thick. Um, sometimes they cut them a little thinner and I just find the ones that are half inch thick, but it is what it is, right? We're trying to stay in budget. Um, got this oxtail. Uh, what else did I get from, before I go into what I got from Aldi? I got these blade steaks which i love um they're a very great price oh like a reg of already 5.99 a pound but to get them 30 percent off is excellent so there's two of them in here for less than four dollars um and i can usually eat one of these per meal more blade steaks more blade steaks more blade steaks and uh, everything with the yellow sticker was 30% off. All right. So I think that's everything with the yellow sticker. So moving on to Aldi. Aldi, you got to look for these red stickers. So I went to Aldi when they first opened at 9 a.m. near me and they had a bunch of meat with yellow stickers. So I got some Italian sausages, half off, half off Italian sausages. So this is 50% off. So that's even a better discount. Some boneless, skinless chicken thighs, which I love. And they're usually super expensive. But they're originally $3.29 a pound. So at 50% off, that brings it to what? $150, about $160 a pound. And usually the best price I can find on boneless, skinless chicken thighs is $1.99 a pound. So this is a great deal. I got two of those. And then they also had a bunch of uh, ground beef. So they had these ground beef patties, which were originally for $29 a pound. Um, at half off, which brings it to two fifteen a pound, which is a great price for eighty twenty ground beef. I got one, two, three, uh, four. I actually got five of these. I ended up making some um, spaghetti yesterday for my partner who is not keto vor, so he can have the pasta. And I'm trying to get rid of it. I shouldn't even have it. So. He got blessed with that and some burgers for him as well. 
And then this is 85 15 ground beef at half off, originally the same price. So again, great price for that. So all of this meat, and then some that you didn't even see because I used it all. Oh, and I had an I had um I used up a pack of this yesterday for dinner. So even more <laughs> blade steaks and even more uh ground beef that I got all for what did I say, like 140? Because I spent about $50 at ShopRite. I spent about another $50 at Cousins. So that's like $100. And then at Aldi, I think I spent like, yeah, about $40. And I got some other things. So just look out for these stickers and go to your grocery stores early um, at ShopRite. I, and you can probably ask the people in the meat department when they put the stickers on. So that way you know you can get there early enough. But I go every Saturday to ShopRite at around 8 15 8 30 and i always get the stickers aldi is really hit or miss but um again you can always ask them the one near me i haven't seen stickers there in a while so that's why i loaded up i got really excited and then cousins just seems to be a good price for some things and you can just check the circular for what they have a good price on so getting a lot of meat on your ketovore carnivore diet doesn't have to be all that expensive this will last me on my own <laughs> literally probably like two months um but if you're partnered i would say that this is easily depending on your diet uh, a month four weeks worth of food if not three if there's more than one of you so yeah just want to give some suggestions on how you can save money on this diet